Black Yoshi Pamelia. Winner of that fight's Puppet and Boss. Stututu. Looks like they're. Uh, I think they're just picking over team choice or uh, state choices right now. I'm not sure what they're gonna actually end up going with. It's not very exciting to commentate this part. Looks like they're uh, they're fist bumping right now. Uh, what's up? Are you ready? It look, it looks good to go. Yeah, you guys should be. Yeah, you should, you should be set. Okay, I think we're gonna get it underway in just a second here then. But what do I know? Because here, here, the game has not started yet, so. There we go. What? You guys are set. Yeah, you know, go ahead. Alright, so in doubles, I think really, this is interesting just because uh, both Lucario and uh, Shulk are both characters I think excel way, way more in doubles than they would in singles. Just because Lucario gets the, uh, the ability to live a lot longer, just it's a lot harder to like, pin, Lucario down, excuse me, pin Lucario down and kill them immediately afterwards. And Shulk's Monado Arts in this range just are much, much more better suited to fighting multiple people than just one. Um, that being said, Reg and really, I think Link is probably more suited for singles. He, he can put a lot of pressure on a lot of different directions, but Link is very much directed in one direction for the most part. Whereas, uh, with, with the exception of like up tilt and up smash, nice back air followed by Brian. But um, since uh, uh, Zephyr, excuse me, uh, Pitzer already in shield but he's gonna come up to uh, bump the shield. Wow, I don't even know what killed him there. That was just a mishmash of attacks, and it managed to knock him out of there. Zephyr gonna eat a back air. That was well spaced and well timed by Brian there. He would not hold. He could have air dodged there, but if he had waited much longer, he wouldn't be able to up you to get back to the stage too. It was it was really really smart placing by that. So right now, fairly fairly close. Blue team technically in a slight uh, slight percentage deficit, but Lucario is at over 100 percent and is going to start actually being a real scary character now. Uh, they uh, if they can't put him down within the next 20 percent or so. It's really going to start being a problem for them, especially when he, uh, if he uh, can snap a stock too. So, nice work, dude. Brian gonna get a follow up in there too. That forward air, it did effectively end the combo, thankfully. So it wasn't like it was a bad forward air, but it also, I, I think he probably could just let him land. But nothing. Red team got the stage control by pretty hardly enough, but Brian's gonna stand up, and get back in. Nice back air is gonna actually take the stock. Forward smash, not quite gonna do it. That's only uh, it's up 100%, so I'm not surprised he survived through that one either. Go to the Shield Monado. At 133, this is about the time he's going to start living in this month. Uh, Shield, I thought, woo, that counter going to pick up two kills. Um, I think one of them on his team. Oh, wow, going to go under the stage with the Jump Monado. I didn't know that was an option. Uh, again, it's another one of those things that I, I feel like I shouldn't be surprised by, and yet I am. So even, oh, he canceled out of the Shield Monado. I doubt he would have survived through that in the first place. That looks very devastating, but... So what are you looking at? Three stocks, three stocks, about the same percentage, about overall. Uh, I, I could literally not give an advantage to either of the teams at the moment. They're both just, they're, they're both really, really uh, even with each other. Ryan gonna go ahead and get a couple up tilts in there on that. Get, ooh, back here, actually gonna connect on the sofa. So, ooh, foot stools, but he's gonna just wait that out. Nice neutral there, nice tech though, he was ready for it, so. Uh, that neutral doesn't, it's not exactly gonna like slam into you, but had he missed that tech, he would have been in. Well, even then, Lucario, oh, that's a broken shield, and that's a free, fully charged forward smash. Uh, I think he might have wanted to consider switching out of the uh, buster, oh, doesn't matter, got the kill. So now he's in Smash Monado, and Smash Monado will put this uh, put this cloud down if he can land the hit on him. Or the shield instead. Ooh, Brian's still alive, just barely. Going back to the buster. Oh, gotta pick up his partner there, but again, even at 130 with that, it's not gonna kill yet, so. Reggie going a little too low. Oh no, that's not what you need to do there. Alright, so we've got three. Oh, this is a Lucario with, with 146%. This is about as scary as the car is gonna be, and that's gonna be a banger. It's gonna end this one. So, for as close as that game was, in one moment, just the uh, the blue team took a momentum and they really, really held on to it extremely tightly. Um, uh, what adjustments do you make to this? They can't let Lucario live as long as they did. That, that's their biggest problem right now, is Brian has been picking up back airs left and right, and it's been devastating them. I don't know that this team comp is the correct team comp for this either, because their, their range advantage they get from having swords is kind of nullified by a... Uh, by uh, Shulk. Lucario gets so strong. He, he, you need to kill Lucario. Being able to, be able to outrange and play the slow game against Lucario doesn't really get you anything other than a scarier Lucario at the end of the day. But Optim vs. Uh, Duck Hunt here. I guess that makes sense because it's kind of FD ish. And it's got platforms, but really they're not going to get anything out of them. It's not going to ruin your combos or nothing. 
So, ooh, already comboing both of them, but the counter, well done by Brian, just to end that little string they had going there. It was really, really smart just to be like, no, uh, we can't. Oh, wow, oh, that's so unfortunate. Brian, or excuse me, Silva trying to get a bomb up in the air, and uh, chucks it up as right as a duck spawns and ends up hitting himself. But it did, nothing bad came of it, it was just <laughs> an unfortunate circumstance. Nice up air from Hits are gonna put him up in a bad position. He's gonna down air just to get his momentum back. Back on the ground again for Zephyr. He's gonna charge that up. It's not gonna connect with anything. Reggie's gonna connect with an up, up smash, put uh, Pitzer up in the air. Pitzer going into shield, so we won't be seeing a Pitzer death anytime soon. But he's, he's uh, also not gonna be exactly horrifying as far as his speed goes. There is the end of shield. Nice. Zephyr smart. If Zephyr had gone for an attack there, he probably would have eaten that Aura Sphere. Interesting there, uh, Zephyr gets the pin on Brian and opts not to do any kick afterwards. I think he's probably looking for uh, Sova to come actually get a follow-up, and Sova was just not prepared for it, so... That's, that's life, though. Nice shield by Brian. Wow, wow, like, forward throw took that stock, actually. Oh my goodness, uh, So, it's still steaming tight, just because Link is with much lower percent, but this Lucario, you can't let Lucario live to 140%. This Lucario needs to have been dead. Far, far, far beyond this. That's gonna take it. Though, there so. you go. He finally got it. That's what you call the YDG special. Exactly. Yes. That how the how the heck is this uh, Lucario still alive? <laughs> yeah. You, you look over there and you're like, this, this is not okay. He's he's an unstoppable juggernaut at this point. Yeah. So. He's got his aura. He's got his rage. It's never a good thing to live no, And that that's the thing about Lucario and doubles in particular is you get a lead in stocks and Lucario actually gets aura from that as well. And it's it's really scary because it's like, oh, I thought you know I felt like I'd be rewarded for winning. Turns out no, you're not. <laughs> you're punished for winning. Don't win, you idiot. You need to win correctly. <laughs> you win the wrong way, he, it's, it's not okay. I do love I do love the Lucario Shulk team, because it's it not something you get to see very often. Nice. The, the, the Smash Up B is definitely going to clear that other. Yeah, these are both unconventional characters, but not ones that you see a whole lot of in bracket. So, I don't know. Uh, Pitzer, I think, primarily throws a Bayonetta now in, in actual like tournament. But, but that might just be in the broad matchup. I know I only ever see it, so. Yeah. Zephyr with the up smash try, but actually very simple. These counters have really, really been on point. Nice dash attack and a follow-up, but not going to kill him out. You'll just yeah. Yep. That would, that's how you have to beat Lucario. You have to get him out of there at like 80 or 90. Yep. You can't afford to let him get all of his momentum going. So I'm looking at the score and I'm looking at the map. This map was chosen by Unknown and Zephyr? Yes, that's correct. Huh. I, I thought I felt the same way at first. I was like, I don't really see what they're trying to accomplish here. I, they, wouldn't, they wouldn't get out of FD or if they wanted platforms, they wanted just like a Dreamland or something maybe. I don't know. It's, it might be the blast zones. I, I don't know if that's something you'd have to talk about. Wow, that combo into the backslash. Did, did you see that actually turn? Because when you get hit, you turn to face the attack to hit you, which put his back towards the backslash yep. and gave him the strong attack. Pitzer was... at 175 right now. Excuse me, never mind. <laughs> zero. <laughs> yeah, Pitzer is our never mind. But, uh, okay, Pitzer is dead. They they need to close Lucario. Again, Lucario, 140%. This is not a thing you can let Lucario there do. We go. There it Great is. job by Soa to pick that up. Not only that, but he spaced extremately well to let Nadia uh, catch his teammate in. I mean, it wouldn't have been the end of the world. He's only at like 30%. But yeah, but it's oh, the an added bonus. Duck. He was ready for the down air follow up on that throw, but the duck on the way and just bounced him up. So. Exactly. A weird level. So. So. To be fair, it is their advantage right now. It is three stocks to two, but and it's fairly tight percentage. But at that same point, like if, if you don't kill Lucario and Lucario gets his momentum going, it's not going to matter how much stocks you have. Yeah, exactly. Well, it comes down to does the Corrin die first or does somebody on the blue team die exactly. first? Exactly. Pretty much, this a lot of situations in doubles you'll find is dictated by who gets the two v one situation first. Ooh, once got a, good, one, get the good shield poke there. Once upon a time, Listen that could have potentially been a shield break, but. They have unfortunately nerfed that for for Mr. Brian YDG. Yeah. Also with doubles, you got to follow up there. Exactly. Great, great follows up. This is doing a really good job there by Silva. They, they have such stage control right now. Silva just man mode that very they, hard. They, they've got them split up and they're not letting. Them oh, nice. oh, there it is. Interesting. A forward smash. All right. Not gonna oh, take that's it yet, but Pitzer is an extremely talented doubles player as far as the two v one goes. It's just that I feel like this is a difficult two characters. From the, these are two characters that can do. Link is so oh, strong. It's not gonna matter. I mean, that's that's great work by him to take the stock in the first place. But he's still got a long, long, long way to go at 146 percent, 147 now. Yeah, and it's not like okay, cool. Maybe in some weird world he gets rid of that corn. Wow, that. But that I mean, do you beat Silva when he's got that big of an advantage on you? No. There it is. And uh, Zephyr's gonna go eh, stab <laughs> you in the face. <laughs> Poked a big hole in his head, unfortunately, so. Is this well, three, out of, three out of five or two out of three for these? Three out of five? Well, oh, two out of three. Are we in losers? This is losers semis. After this, we have losers finals, and then after that, we have grants, so. All right, looks good. So we, we, we you can see both teams there and Zion chewing gum. <laughs> exactly. He, he texts in. Pretty aggressively. Let, let, let his girl know what's going on. It's important stuff. Exactly. So who we still got left in this thing? What's up? Who took winners? 
Wait, Cup A and Boston. Yeah. Well, okay, there we yeah, go. Really, I mean, that it, it was a shocking Have they dropped upset. the game yet? Uh, yeah, they had Pitzer and, uh, uh, excuse me, Promillion Black Yoshi took a game. I don't know if anybody else God, those did. Those guys are so good, though, man. They, they like, are. They're, they're, they're a scary I love team. their teamwork. It's uh, the, the stuff they set up with each other. I think, uh, I actually feel like their uh, Palutena has worked better than their Corrin. I was going to say, how has Corrin been doing ever her, since her minor, well, not even minor, oh. since her relatively large nerf that she just got? So, yeah, any movement speed nerf is going to be a big deal. Or any movement buff is a big deal as well. Like, that and weight nerfs are another thing that actually matters. Just because anytime you, like, take weight away from somebody, that's just the survivability that's every time. Yeah. Every time they're gonna die a little bit sooner. So right away, pretty early lead for blue team, but I mean, these early leads like this very rarely shake out to mean much of yeah, anything. Yeah, you just gotta learn the map, get used to it. You exactly. know, there's no longer ducks just hanging out. So <laughs> no, for sure, like there's not gonna like Reggie lost a lot of follow-ups to ducks and lost a lot of, yeah, hit himself with bombs and stuff. So it's uh. For, the, for their own counter pick, you would have expected him to be able to play around that a little better. But it was even, bizarre. Even then, it's not like he didn't play around it correctly. It's not like a skill thing. It's just that he just happened to do things and there happened to be ducks there, which will happen sometimes. Yeah, because ducks wow. come out randomly. That side B from Lucario at 94%. Lucario's with the is no range. joke, man. Lucario said, excuse me, here's my command grab. I, I will would... sit here and talk about... Oh, he went for another one there. Reggie managed to spot dodge it, though. So up smash will do that 140%. Very handily. Yep. He got the Shulk out there, caught in the uh, jump for him. I'm sure he would rather have been oh, yeah. in a shield at that point. At but that point, yes. But I mean, even that, with an up smash 140, I don't know that he would survive. Nice back air from Brian. Yeah, he's a There it is. That's going to kill that Link. Wow, oh. no. Link alive? Well, the Cario not. So, going to rain down some bombs. Carpet bombing. That's... It, there's, it, there's one thing that's always impressed me. Since day one, Reggie's ability to just survive. Yes. Sova, so Sova's ability to survive is akin to nothing else I've seen here. He, he just doesn't go away. You're like, I really would like you to stop having stocks. I'm surprised Zephyr didn't go for forward smash there. He yeah. Had, he had him charging that, and he got a, a much stronger punish after that. That forward throw is going to kill him with yeah. the platform help there. Up smash, not going to kill it, but he did catch his teammate. I hope his teammate was such a low percentage, it was not like he was any real danger. Oh, of course. Crazy Every guy, once in so. a while, I got to take the get. Exactly. So. It's just that you, you can't be afraid to hit your teammate sometimes. It's just you have to understand the situation you're in. So if you're yep. gonna kill your teammate, not your enemies at ten percent, like then maybe maybe don't maybe your not big worth attack. it. But but I mean if if it's their, the inverse, they're even sixty and it's like ninety, and you're like maybe I could get the kill even if you're not sure. It's a nice up air gonna clear Great that. Great job there. So, there. so, so and, talks. and just like that, this game is all of a sudden in command. It's not. Well, it's fairly close. But if they can close this corn out immediately. Um, was that Brian's best option there for a kill potential? I, I think he threw the. I think he did the back throw just to get him to his teammate. Over yeah, there. I suppose. With Silver there, it seems like a rough. There nice, we go. Great there move. Okay, so. so Great. I mean, oh, wonderful one-two there. Three socks up. So it's it's really it's all gonna. It just depends on who can close these out because Lucario has the potential to get really really scary here. Can uh, we just talk for a second about how much I love that we're watching a high-level doubles match with no top tens in it? That's true. I mean, I, 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 I definitely. I think that's really nice. This is this is loser semis. This is top three. Yeah. Um, and like, and yeah, not a single character is like, oh, was that one broken character? Oh my goodness, betrayed his own partner there. But he, oh, he picked up Brian. I didn't even notice that. So really, that's actually a very, very good trade. For yeah, there, get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that uh, raging Lucario. Ex exactly, just because Brian's stock is a much more high value stock than uh, than Silva's was at that point. I agree. But yeah, it's definitely the right call. I, oh, they're gonna get some jabs. Just put some pressure on them. They both have like the same jab. That's interesting. Now it's just a matter of can they close pits can around? Can Shulk, yeah, Shulk is gonna have to have a hard time here. But then, that's the thing, Shulk will do extremely well in doubles is survive. So what are you gonna do? He's in Shield Monado, not like you're gonna make him go away. Oh no, yeah, in Shield Mode, he, he goes up to like one of the top seven heaviest characters in the game in Shield Mode. I think he's the heaviest character in the game in Shield Mode, actually. Is he really? I'm, if I'm not mistaken, he's the hardest character to kill in the game. Oh yeah, you'll, you'll frequently see him get to 140, 150 without right. too much problem. And then you'll, you'll hit him with moves at 140 and have it not matter, so. And that's the thing is, he's so strong when he's in Shield, he's just slow. Oh, that counter. They're going to get him through the projectiles, All but right. not going to do anything. That shield mode is going to start running out here in a second, though, so we're going to have to look oh, out. The Oop, he's see, lucky, though. He's lucky. He had that shield just, just in time. Yeah, exactly. Now he goes into jump, and he plays safe. You get out of the way. You block, you move, you jump. It's just he gets he gets enough mobility. He's he's just gonna wait it out. So he's just, he's just looking for shield back. Cause you have a closer match right now. No, oh my God, see so Lucario finally. There we go, back in shield. shield. Yep, back in shield. This is what he's been waiting. Now he can actually go try to fight things. He can he can afford to, to gamble on some stuff. Oh, That's I don't like the backslash there. Not a gamble I would have chosen to take there. Yeah, not against not against a player uh, the, the like the caliber of Zephyr. Exactly. No, he knows. See, at this point, I almost feel like he should be looking for a, like. <laughs> Jump was, I think he needs to make something happen. I think, I think, this, call me crazy, I think you go smash and hopefully you hit something with something. See, that's, that's what I thought at first too, but I thought about it, I was like, look at the percents. I mean, smash is not going to get him a kill that, that the regular That he wouldn't would. have already gotten? Yes. Yeah, so, that's okay. fair. 
There it that. is. Good job, Brian. Okay, so yeah. Now this is this is not this is close enough where whatever this could be anybody. Exactly. Corn, you can't kill a corn until level 110, 120 anyway. That's true. Even with your aura or your smash on. Uh, I'm not sure what corn's gonna do against these two though, because Pitzer Pitzer is already really good at two v one, and Brian's already really good. At two yeah, two. all of her great Ooh, moves wow. also just have an incredible amount of in time on them. Oh, well, wow, you could do that. One. That's one. So let's see. Let's you could do that. That's there a, it is. That's, that's, that's game. It's, no, it's not. It's got shield on. Oh wow! Look at that. But. but Boy! Oh, he's making it through. Nice air dodge. Just really, really patient. Pitzer! Pitzer! Oh, he's looking for smash now. Oh! Oh, boy. Oh, boy. God, this is a match, man. This is, is so good. Going into jump. He's looking to solve it. He needs shield. I don't that was it. I don't think he can outlast it. No. Corrin's got too many. There, 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 I mean, Corrin's with that range. It's, you're, you can't evade Corrin for that long, unfortunately. No, you really can't. He, he got a corner of the ledge, and he was just going, no, I'm going to get you yeah. with something. Even, Sorry, with this, even with the move speed bus and everything, if you're just this right is, there in that corner. This is mine, right? No, that's not. I don't, that, I don't know where any of my stuff went, actually. Yeah, this is mine. It's got this goop on it right there. Nice. Love the goop. Exactly. That was a good one, though. That was. That was, that was, that was an incredible. So.